Take me to her. Is she really that important? More than anything. <laughs> the, oh, train. the train's going off. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, welcome back to Have You Heard About, the internet show where I ruin my friends' lives with content they were never supposed to see. So far on this series, we've tackled a lot of weird and niche stuff all across the web, but today we have something a bit unique, because this wasn't originally on the internet for the longest time. So in a sense, you can kind of call it lost media, but I'm mainly just saying that this wasn't originally recorded with the intent of being put online in the first place. That being said though, the reason we're able to watch this at all is because because a DVD containing it was discovered at a thrift store and graciously uploaded to YouTube. <laughs> oh, oh no. no. This is an hour. <laughs> this isn't just an hour, this is Kingdom Hearts 2 the movie. Contrary to what you might think of that title, it's not official. It's, it's not official at all. This movie was actually first found at a thrift store in California and bought for a dollar by an internet user who went by the name Wimmy slash Waxoff. It was first uploaded to YouTube back in 2017 before it was taken down for copyright violations. The movie contained a lot of copyrighted music, like a lot, Kingdom Hearts and otherwise. Which then brings us to the film itself. The reason why it uses so much copyrighted music is because it was never intended to be posted online. Kingdom Hearts 2 the movie was originally created as a passion project amongst a group of kids who were just really big fans of the games. With a title like that, I'm sure you could guess it's an adaptation of the story of Kingdom Hearts 2 in a feature length format acted out by a group of children. <laughs> Now this is where it gets kind of interesting. Through complete happenstance, one of the kids who originally worked on the movie found one of the uploads. And unlike what you might think, he was actually super chill about it and even answered a couple of questions about its production. Now they're kind of unsure on this, but based on what him and his friends believe, the reason that it ended up at a thrift store was because one of the original DVDs that it was burned to was left over at a friend's house. This friend's parents probably found the DVD set and ended up selling it to the store. I really like the one comment on this video that just says nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a producer of Kingdom Hearts. You know that we're getting niche when like there's only one comment on the video. This video has straight up 93 views. So, oh, also, I should note, the original upload did get taken down like I said earlier. The only reason I know about this is thanks to one of our viewers, Zelda XVA. Not only did they make me aware of this, but they also re-uploaded it to YouTube for us to watch. So shout out to you, my dude. Thanks a ton. Love you. Kiss, kiss. God, I can't wait to be disappointed by Kingdom Hearts again. <laughs> it's not hard. It's not hard. I, actually, no, I, I should I should preface this by saying I haven't played Kingdom Hearts 2 yet. <laughs> <laughs> wait, did you... Wait, which Kingdom Hearts did you play? Only one? The last one that I played was the one with the cards. So, did you beat, if anything... Did you beat Chain of Memories? No, I didn't beat Chain of Memories. Oh, you're going to get some spoiled for you. I mean, it doesn't make sense anyway. <laughs> I already kind of know what happens at the end of Chain of Memories. People already spoiled it for me. <laughs> oh, oh God. I'm going to have to heavily cut this down because Disney will literally chokehold me with their long, scrawny fingers. But, like, <laughs> I think you get the point. This looks like a video they play in a fucking true crime series on Netflix. Jesus. <laughs> oh, this is my shit. I'm going to be real with y'all. This is my shit. I mean, the props are actually really high quality. I want to give you guys a quick warning. This is as good as the sound quality is going to get for, for the remainder of the film. Wait, what's happening with Sora in this hotel room? Ladies and gentlemen of Twilight Town, I'd like to introduce for you Sparrow! And the three yeah! that have made it this far. Yo, when Sony said that their new system had 4K, they were not shitting. <laughs> this is what PlayStation graphics will look like in 2014. <laughs> I honest to God think that somebody should definitely, like, take the title of that, like, PS5 test video and just <laughs> take this scene and upload that with the title of the PS5 test video. Don't you hate when you're breakdancing with your bros and just some guy with a bunch of uh, blunt objects walks up try start hitting you? I love the I love the fire effect to be the battle arena. Oh my god. That is pretty interesting though. Was that a jump cut or did I like have a stroke? No, <laughs> it was a jump cut. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you live another day, Gerber. Damn. 
<laughs> I think we lost a minute there. <laughs> <laughs> He's so hot! <laughs> Tag yourself, I'm that guy sitting in the back. <laughs> I'm definitely the mom in the park walking with her kid going, What the hell is happening over there? <laughs> yeah, she got the candles! She wins! <laughs> Could they not buy like a $2 trophy that they just used a candle opera that their mom had? <laughs> Imagine it's like their family heirloom candelabra and they just stole it to go play in the park. <laughs> Yo, Roxas just straight up died. Oh my gosh, it's Mickey! <laughs> I just love the idea of Mickey's just like a big dude. It's a middle-aged dad. Guys, it's the darkness! <laughs> I'm not messing with the guy who could flip. I like how they started with the guy who could flip. Well, do you think that guy like requested when he was like asked to be in this? He's like, I want to flip. Cutting back and forth, and it just... It's like a YouTube poop. <laughs> Do you think that Mickey is just their dad? <laughs> yes. That's why I said it's like a middle-aged dude. They probably got their dad to dress up like Mickey Mouse. Like, I gotta say, if that is their dad, that's so cute. That's adorable. Yeah, of course. Like all of this is just like it's just like a bunch of friends and they're they're like their dad having fun in the park. Like there's nothing wrong yeah. with it. Yeah. No, yeah, this is like a nice cute thing. <laughs> you may not like it, but this is what peak performance looks like. So do you think <laughs> the computer exploded when they put this into Premiere? Or whatever 2007 know. editing was? Well, th that was like Sony <laughs> Vegas 6 time, baby. That was the height of me editing stuff. And I got to say, program hasn't changed since then. <laughs> Are you okay, Base? You sound upset about no. it. No. Wow, they ki they killed him. Whoa! <laughs> what rating is this oh. movie? <laughs> you think maybe like that wasn't even scripted? He just like he's like, man, nobody knows their freaking stage directions. <laughs> Take me to her. Is she really that important? More than anything. <laughs> the, train. oh, the train's going off. <laughs> <laughs> again, again, when he falls to the ground, that's just not scripted. He's just so fed up. Uh, what? 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 <laughs> Aim chat room. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? <laughs> oh, this is real dated. Is it weird that I still somehow think that this is accurate to Kingdom Hearts? No. <laughs> Big Pimpin' Mickey has left. 2020 is truly down the shitter. <laughs> no. I want Big Pimpin' Mickey back. I'm just now realizing, those two kids with Sora, are they supposed to be are Donald and Goofy? <laughs> Yeah, uh, the the bigger g the guy had the shield. Oh my god! My only critique of this fan film is that the girl is not doing a horrible Donald Duck impression. Like she should be sounding like. <laughs> I hate how accurately you do that. Wow! Holy crap! Donald Duck is here with us. Wow. <laughs> He's just vibrating in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they turned the saturation way up. Wow, just like in the games, Heartless are like everywhere. <laughs> if there's one thing that they had super accurate, I just want to ask Pasty, how much are you enjoying this? I have completely checked out. <laughs> <laughs> I, ju I mean, I just- I have no idea what's going on. It just looks like a bunch of kids on a fucking home movie running around in the park. Like, I have no idea what's supposed to be happening. You know what to do. King Mickey, forgive me. Farewell. <laughs> Yo, he the did. The himself to death. He did. The final battle, guys. Are you ready? 
Yo, he has lightsabers. That is unfair. <laughs> Somebody was just doing laundry in the. <laughs> it's bad. This is like the same quality of like a fight scene you'd see in like a filthy Frank video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I gotta ask, wh what is up with this this Sora Wait. and taking off his jacket and hitting his opponent with it? It sounds like someone's like clocks going off with the music. I was about to say, Gerber, that's a piano. <laughs> yeah, it sounds it, it sounds like you know when a clock goes off at every hour. I liked how the piano, the music was clipping. <laughs> Oh, Derek, I'm going to tell you, I have to play Recoded for this moment. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm like a guy just walking in the back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they fucking murdered Riku, finally. <laughs> oh, they're killing Sora, too! <laughs> oh my god! Did you love the ending of the game where Sora's friends just jump him? <laughs> Donald and Goofy have had enough. Wow. Also, I like, like the hip hop uh, font. You'll see on like mid 2000s rap albums. <laughs> it's always got to end on somebody giving the, me their mixtape or something. God, fuck. Oh, they have an after credits scene too. <laughs> fuck that. Should we just skip to that instead of watching the credits? Yeah, we're not watching the credits. We're not watching the after credits scene. Come on, dude. They're really important. We got to stick around and watch them. There might be some lore that they might reveal and that'll be I'll, important in the next movie. I'll, I'll spoil it for you. They all go and get Slim Jims like the Avengers did in that one scene. Fuck. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great if they made a Kingdom Hearts live action of like Kingdom Hearts 3 like Dude, <laughs> like 15 years great. later? Yo, you know what we should do? Uh, we should get Robert Downey Jr. to play Sora and Tom Holland should play uh, Goofy. Da Goofy. Terrence uh, Howard to play <laughs> Donald for one movie and then replace him with Don Cheadle in the next one. Yeah, you should do all that because Marvel movies are the only actors that matter, you know? And I want this to be directed by Bong Joon-ho. Anyway, uh... <laughs> Honestly, I don't think that I can top that. I think, we, I think we've, done, we've seen enough for this one. Damn, finally Derek's admitted something that he can't top. <laughs> <laughs> Because that was truly a power bottom moment. <laughs> Bottoms be like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, so you're stealing my line again, huh? I see how it is. You didn't invent being a bottom pasty. No, no, I'm not the saying that. the group's bottom. It's, it's in his contract. It is in my... Oh, you guys got a contract? 